structure is a collection of variables of different data types as compared to array which are collection of similar data types structure is collection of variables of different data types so inside of a structure you can have collection of variables of data type int float character and so on now let us check how we can define a structure so struct is a standard keyword in C which is used to define your structure. So after struct you can write your structure name and then inside of curly braces you can have collection of your variables which can have any data type. Notice a semicolon at the end of this structure definition which is compulsory to have. Now let us check how we can declare a structure variable. To declare a structure variable we again use keyword struct and then structure name and after that you write your variable name. So variable name is a variable of type structure name there is one more method using which you can declare your structure variable that is you can immediately write your variable name after structure definition so that is between curly brace and the semicolon now let us check how we can access data members of a structure so this is your variable of type structure and we use a dot operator and after that we write member name so if i have a structure student and inside it there is a variable as role then if we declare a variable of type student which is the structure then we can access a role using this syntax that is std one dot role now let us check how we can initialize the structure variable so there are two ways to do it immediately after your structure definition you can specify your variable name and using equal to operator you can initialize value of that structure variable so inside of structure student i have a character array then an integer and a float variable so i'm initializing it with a string an integer and then finally a float variable so this corresponding value will go inside of std one dot name equal to prashant then std dot role equal to 10 and then finally std one dot marks equal to 77.99 there is one more method using which you can initialize your variable so when you have your structure defined you can simply write struct structure name and your variable name for that structure and then you can specify values for your structure 